It is possible to resize images at any point during the editing process, but there are a few things to be aware of. In Adobe Photoshop, that will be image and then image size, where you'll be presented with the most important information regarding your document. At the top of the dialog box, where it reads image size of 28.9 megabytes, that really means the saved file size. Whilst dimensions, give us the width and height in pixels of 4240 by 2384. Now we also have the width and height articulated in inches. Notice the width and height is linked so that if we were to alter one, the other would be affected proportionately and we avoid distorting the image. Which brings us finally to resolution. This is something that we would only concern ourselves with in regards to print output and not screen or web. Now the figure of 72 is an industry standard. If you capture an image with a digital camera or download stock content from a website, the resolution will be set to 72 PPI. Now that can give you a false impression of the size it can be printed out. Here, looking at this image, you might be forgiven for thinking it could be printed at 60 inches by 33 inches, there or thereabouts. However, when we're talking about print output, the resolution needs to be at 300 PPI, not 72. So to discover the natural maximum print size for an image, you'll first have to turn off resample. That will create a link between not only the width and height, but also resolution. If we were now to alter the data in any one of those three fields, the other two will update accordingly. So if I change the resolution from 72 to 300 PPI, notice as I do so, the inches shrink down in size. In order for us to get the right kind of quality, we have to make the image smaller to pack together more pixels per linear inch to increase the detail to achieve the right kind of print quality. So as we've established here, this image shouldn't really be printed out any larger than 14 inches by eight inches. There may however be situations where you don't need the image to be so large. In that case, you can turn back on the resample chat box to reinstate a link between just the width and height and then type in a lower physical size. And although the physical size has reduced to 10 inches by 5.6, the resolution has remained the same. Also notice that the pixel dimensions have also reduced in size, now 3000 by 1687. And this would allow us to achieve a lower file size rather than keeping a high resolution image where it's not required. This technique is referred to as downsampling, and it's a very common one that you'll have to use. 